Hello, this is Rakesh Rao from Design Sense, the Brixis India distributor. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add and delete a vertex from a hatch in BricsCAD. Using the normal hatch commands in BricsCAD, it's not possible to remove the vertex or add a vertex to the hatch. You can do that using our CAD Power software. So if you go to the miscellaneous tools under CAD procedures in first set, we have these two commands called insert vertex in hatch boundary and delete vertex from hatch boundary. So if I choose the insert vertex command, I select the hatch and then I can pick a new boundary point to add. So I need to pick any point which is near the segment and you can see that the add option is activated. You can pick a point and automatically add a new vertex or you can pick a point and enter the distance from the midpoint. You can see there is a red mark here and it's asking you pick a new location for the inserted vertex or enter distance from midpoint. So if I enter a distance like say 150, you can see that a new point was added here at a distance of 150 from the middle of the segment. So that is how you add a new point to a hatch in BricsCAD. In a similar manner, if you want to delete the hatch, it's you use the next command, delete vertex, select the hatch and pick the vertex to delete. So if I want to delete this and this, so these two vertices have been deleted. So that's how you delete a vertex. Now what if you don't have a boundary around the hatch? You need to first create the boundary using the generate hatch generate boundary command. So once you have created the boundary using this command, you can, you know, it becomes an associative hatch and then you can use the insert and delete vertex commands. In AutoCAD also the same commands are available, but it is not required because in AutoCAD you can you have an option already called add vertex so using the add vertex command you can add a new hatch the hatch insert and delete commands are available from the command line as well so if you type cp underscore hatch you can see that these two commands delete vertex and insert vertex are available from command line thank you for watching this video